Hey everyone, how's it going? Back here again, playing more Lost Ark, boys, heck yeah. And it's a little special today, because uh, I believe yesterday actually, so today is Friday, April 22nd, 2022. So on uh, yesterday, April 21st, uh, Lost Ark dropped a huge update. Um, I think this is probably one of the bigger updates uh, since launch, I think, so it's, I guess, gonna be pretty cool to go through and experience. So yeah, they added a bunch of, uh, a lot of new things to the game. Uh, they added a new continent, uh, South Vern, which has opened up, and we've already um, been through North Vern before, so we already know that area, but South Vern was closed off and now it's opened up, so there's a new continent that you could visit. South Vern, I'm not sure what the... Um, I'm not sure what tier uh, South Vern is. Probably gonna, probably the latest tier, tier three. I'm assuming. Uh, I'm not sure. We'd have to go like check it out though to really find out. But um, yeah, they added a new continent, so they added South Vern, and they also added a new class, so you can now become a Glavier, which I uh, I think they use like um, like long polearm type weapons, like polearm glaive weapons. I don't know. Uh, and they just do like some freaking like Lubu, Wubu type ish. And um, seems pretty cool to me. Uh, I saw a little bit of the showcase in a video on YouTube. And some of the abilities, they look pretty cool. They look a lot better than freaking Deadeye abilities. Deadeye abilities are freaking lame, man. Freaking Lost Ark, man. I freaking picked the wrong character. You gotta make my characters freaking cooler. I have a freaking Deadeye. But yeah, I wanted to show you guys. I usually start the game in game, but I wanted to show you guys the new. Uh, loading screen because it looks pretty cool. It's like all of the um, the demon commanders here, or uh, some of them at least. Oh, actually, no, it's all of them. And we got uh, who is this? I think this might be. That's not Beatrice, right? That's definitely not Beatrice. It sh Beatrice looks a little different. Kind of looks like Beatrice, though. That's the only thing I can assume this lady is. But it looks like we got the squad here. Obvious. Oh, and it's the um, it's the uh, oh, what's his face? It's the Yoda dude. Sideral, uh, frick, what's his name? Shandy, Shandy, that's his name, yeah. So we got Shandy over here. Uh, who is this, though? I'm not sure who this is. The guy with the Sephiroth looking ass. I'm not sure who this is, but we got Shandy. Someone who I assume is Beatrice. I can't, this freaking thing needs to freaking screw off this event notice. I'm trying to see the whole thing. But uh, we have, yeah, I think Beatrice and some randos. We got some guy, one of the dwarf people. That's pretty cool. This is a pretty cool loading screen. I thought it was pretty cool. Maybe, maybe you guys could see. So this this came with the new update, by the way. Uh, so let's go into my server, which is Karta. Um, if you guys watched my first video, you can see me picking my server, which I do suggest you guys go watching, aka watch the first Lost Ark video. There are 50 parts, guys. What is this? Uh, oh yeah, and there's an, uh, also an event happening right now, guys. So, guys, when Lost Ark does their events, Make sure you guys get your hours in, you know? You guys want to be playing the game during those times. Uh, maybe you took a little break or whatever, but if you're, you know, done taking a break, I would suggest logging on right now because there's going to be probably a whole new event pass thing, uh, a bunch of free stuff, you know? And if you uh, like spending money, I'm pretty sure once you, if you spend money during the event, it's going to be even more rewarding. Um, I'm, I'm not too sure about that, but that's what I'm assuming. I mean, that's what it's gotta be, right? Or else it's just gonna freaking suck dong. But anyways, guys, let's go check out the new class. So we can be a Glavier, right? Uh, what is the Glavier? No, uh, no. Uh, this Berserker, Gunlancer, Paladin, Mage, Martial Artist, Gunner. Is it part of the Martial Artist? It, it shouldn't be a part of the Martial Artist, right? Yeah, no. Gla oh, it is part of the Martial Artist. Okay, so it looks like... A Glavier is a martial artist female character. Okay, interesting. And yeah, let's just let's just take a look at the the showcase here of the abilities. I mean, these are always cool, right? Yeah, this guy looks pretty cool. This girl looks pretty cool. Oh, that was pretty nice. Wow, and they summon like a tornado and shit. Oh shit, she's freaking doing some crazy shit. God damn. I think that was it. 
Alright, uh, I don't know what my next character is going to be. Man, I freaking whiffed on my character selection. I picked freaking Deadeye, dude. I freaking goofed up. I should have at least picked, like, Artillerist or Sharpshooter. Because Deadeye is definitely the weakest one out of these three. Uh, definitely. But, uh, what can you do? My showcase is probably gonna be lame as hell. Man, look at this showcase. It's lame as hell, bro. Why did I... I should have watched the showcases before I freaking... Man, before I pick my character, I goofed. I mean, I like Deadeye, though. Deadeye is still fun to play. I like how you can, like, switch between the weapons. It's really cool, but... I wish there were more abilities. Especially because, like, some of my abilities are whack. But, um, anyways, let's just... We're not gonna make a new character today. We're gonna stick to our main here. Uh, my main, which is the Hello B, which is the Deadeye, unfortunately. A Deadeye. And, uh, we're just gonna play the game, though. You know, we're just gonna play the game. I don't really care about, like, meta, heroes, or whatever. You know what? Screw it. I wanna play what I wanna freaking play. And, I've, and if my character freaking sucks, then frick, man. I feel sorry for my teammates, but... Shit, that ain't a... That, that seems like it's a you... Pro it's a their, them problem, you know? Like a you problem. It's like, maybe it... And then maybe it'll turn into a me problem, because they're gonna rage at me, but... Freaking whatever. We haven't gotten to that point yet. Maybe we'll get to that point eventually. Okay, here we go, guys. So we're in the game. New update. Major, huge update, by the way. So this is what we are greeted with. So we have the event quest. A chance to grow hot. Express character. Event period 421 to 630. I believe that's June 30th. April, do you remember March, April... May, June, yeah, June 30th. So pretty much July 1st, kind of. I mean, not really July 1st, it's June, but... It's like a two-month event. Pretty cool, pretty cool. Um, please select a character to participate, so we can... Oh, and we got right here. I didn't read this uh, down below. Only one character may be chosen per account for Super Express Mission. <sighs> Should I use it on the Deadeye, guys? I mean, it's my main. Screw it. Screw it all. YOLO. Um, what is this? Super Express Mission Event. Select the participating character? Sure. Okay, oh, and we have, uh, what we have here. We have, like, an event... ...log. A bunch of mission, a mission log here. So it looks like we have a bunch of missions here, and they provide rewards. Pretty cool, pretty cool. Uh, these ones kind of stink because, I mean, we, we already passed, or we have these items, but they're already, uh, honed up and stuff, so. These ones stink, we'll probably have to, like, dismantle these, we'll just claim it though, why not, because, you know, get the free thingies. So, um, let's see, so we just have a bunch of things that we have to do, so what is this, training room, advanced, learn about weak points. So just, like, a bunch of things, like, I like this, actually, it helps you, helps the, uh, player get more, you know, used to, like, the mechanics and, like, what the weak point is, because I don't know what a weak point is, so this would be kind of good to do for me, because I'm a noob, and I don't know what weak point is, so that'd be cool to find that out. Or maybe the weak point is doing, like, back attacks and, like, front attacks. I mean, I don't know. There's, this will still be good to learn, though. We got, like, Chaos Dungeon, uh, Una's Task, Level 1 Guardian Soul Harvest, I'm not sure what that is. Oh, Guardian Soul, this is from Guardian Raids, so we have to defeat a Guardian Boss, or Guardian... Raid boss. Uh, okay. Alright, so pretty cool stuff. Um, what is this? Oh, we can't even see level 3. Unlock. Complete all the preceding levels to unlock. Okay, cool. And you got a bonus here. Uh, oh, we got some entry tickets to the cube. Oh, some more entry tickets to cube. Got some silvers. What is this? Rift piece. Probably something that you get uh, later on down the road. Or probably useful later or later on down the road. All right, well that's cool. So we got our event going on. Um, what is this? And we got uh, guys. Yes, this is awesome. We got a new login event. So the last event, if you guys were watching my videos, which I do suggest you guys go watch. Oh, well, while I'm talking about my, uh, my videos, I might as well say make sure you guys like and my like like the videos and subscribe to the channel. Okay, we're done. All right. But if anyways, if you guys saw my last couple of videos, the login event pass thingy whatever you call it it only had five um rewards 
But now the list is full again, guys. So make sure, say, I said it once, I'll say it again. But make sure you guys get your hours in in Lost Ark because there's a bunch of free goodies that they're giving you. And these are good. So you get some uh, Harmony Shards, Life Shards, and Honor Shards. These are all really useful stuff. You know, really good stuff. Uh, okay, what is this? Boss Rush tickets. Okay. Cube tickets. These are all very nice. Alright, let's do it. Let's just accept this. I need to be logging in now. Ooh, this is... This is gonna, we're gonna be getting some juicy things here. I like these. I like this. Okay, let's accept this. Yeah. Oh, I, oh my god. My inventory is so, like, packed. I need to, like, get more space. How do I get more space in my inventory, dude? Oh, it sorts the item out for me. There's an auto sort. Alright, uh, let's just dis- uh, I don't know, should we dismantle these? What, what, what's- are these better? Oh, maybe some of these are better, actually. Swiftness- oh no, this swiftness- this, these aren't better. If, if it was better, it would show the little thing, I forgot. Um... So we have an expertise on. We probably wanna- actually, wait, hold on, we need to be equipping the right, uh, equip. So, we want specialization and we want swiftness. So, what do we have here? We have crit. Crit is okay too, but um, we have engravings and like tripods or whatever that give us crit. So I heard from a you someone on YouTube saying that you know you don't really need to get crit. Get crit. You can do crit if you want to, but there's um, all those things I had said before um, that can give you crit. So you kind of want to do. You kind of want to do specialization and swiftness for Dead Eye. Uh, we could swap out. Oh wait, do we already? Oh, yeah, we, we we can't equip two of these, right? Wait, what? Did I screw that up? Uh, no, we didn't. Um, uh, which one's which one's the better ring, though? Okay, I, I don't really know. Screw it all. Screw it all. Um, what is this? Harmony Leap Stones? Uh, okay, let's talk to, um, um, Bay Azena. Look at her, she looks kind of beautiful, I'm not gonna lie. Very beautiful lady. A little, kind of, kind of a little weird though. She's kind of like half bug that? or something like that, and she's got like multiple personality dis disorder. But it's kind of pretty though. Um, okay, let's read what she has to say. <laughs> the flame elementals. Why did they do that? Yeah, Inanna lost so much power because of them. I mean, Inanna is her other form or whatever. I don't even know. They haven't really explained too much about Azena and like her powers they just we just kind of got introduced to her i mean not really we've kind of seen her for a little bit but kind of we, we kind of just got introduced to her hopefully they i'm just hoping they explain a little bit more about her powers because that'll just be interesting to know as a as a player and someone who's just interested so yeah she says that inana lost a bunch of power which is her other half or whatever uh okay and we have some choices are you okay don't overexert yourself what happened to inana I'll just ask if she's okay. You worry over nothing, I'm okay, but... Dot dot dot. Inanna is growing weaker. It will take time before she can seal the magic. Uh, Silperion would have been in grave danger if it weren't for you. Thank you for all you've done at the Storm Temple. Uh, no problem. There's no time to hesitate. Go to Zanila and seek out Flamekeeper Gerdia. Find out what happened to the Flame Elementals. To find out... Oh wait, find out what happened to the Flame Elementals. Uh, it won't be easy to find him because his power is growing weaker as well. Man, these guys got some weird names, bro. Uh, I've summoned a mage who can help you. Vi uh, visit Dawnkeep. Aberuth will introduce you to her. Okay. So yeah, we still haven't figured out, you know, what's going on with the magic and like what, where the dream demons, because the dream demons really haven't shown themselves yet, or have they shown themselves? Okay, I had. A oh my gosh, I, for I forgot what happened. And I literally had to go back into my video to see what happened. But yeah, we we went to the um. Where do we go to again? <laughs> I still don't know what what's happening. We went to Breeze and Bray, right? And then we went to the oh yeah, the Storm Temple, right? We went to she just you know uh Azana just said it. I'm so dumb. But anyways, we went to the Storm Temple. We fought like some dragon looking thing, like uh Sarion. I don't know if that was the Dream Demon though. It just thought I thought it was just it was just like some random dragon. I don't know. It could have could have been the Dream Demon. I don't know. But we did that, we, we freed the Lightning Elemental Lady, Sulpirion, uh, Inanna used her powers and whatnot, and now we just heard from Azana that she's, you know, getting a little weaker and shit. And now we have to uh, meet Abruth and learn about the Sylvain who can help me? Man, I have no idea what's going on, I still don't know what's going on. Where, where the heck are the Dream Demons? Aren't we supposed to be fighting somebody? 
What's going on? Okay, we, oh, we got some quests though that opened up. I love me some quests. But yeah, we, we still need to find the Ark, which I have no idea where it is because we're doing these freaking shenanigans these guys are telling us to do. Uh, dream Demons. We still haven't really seen the Dream Demons though. Um, and the thing that's like disrupting the magic thing. But you know what? Screw it. It'll eventually all, everything will unfold as it should. I think I'm just worrying a little bit too much. Let's talk to Isariel again. So we're talking to Isariel again. This is the lady that we helped uh, find her band. Um, or her band is missing, or we we, should, we didn't find them. They just like dipped out or something like that because of the magic or something like that. Uh, hello, B. But yeah, we weren't successful. I'm okay now. Actually, I couldn't be better. In fact, I'm feeling up to uh, I'm feeling up to playing some music for the first time in a while. Oh, and she wants to play some music again. Nice. Hello, B. How would you like to perform with me? Oh wow. I guess. I mean. Oh, she just disappeared. Where, wait, where are we going? You ain't even gonna tell me where we're supposed to go? I guess. Wait, what? Oh, okay, we have to go over here. Okay, so all the way over here. So she, man, she just dipped, man. You could, we couldn't have left together. I would have liked to maybe leave together or something. We could have walked there together, had a little conversation, but... I mean, if you just wanna go ahead and just go on and leave, I mean, I guess that's cool too. I didn't click this, by the way, either. So let's check this out, the arc pass. Oh, and this, this guy kind of looks like my character. Wow, the guy character kind of looks like me. Oh, let me show you guys my character. Let me hide my uh, chicken helmet. And we'll hide this too. Oh, I need to switch my hair up though. Oh, we need to get off our mount. Yeah. Kind of looks like me, right? A little bit. Alright, well. Do I like doing this? Do I like having just the head? Without showing the chicken helmet? Yeah, maybe maybe we'll do this for a little bit. Oh, oh wait, no, no, no. Not this. Yeah, we'll do this for a little bit. It's fine. I'll put the chicken head on later, though. But let's check out the arc pass. What is this? Uh, Noble Banquet. Before um, April 21st, 2022. Oh, it's just telling you uh, when it's going on. Uh, what is this? Wallpaper Noble Banquet. Super Premium Reward. Okay, I'm clicking it. Nothing's happening. Oh, arc level 30. Oh, you have to, you have to level up your uh, pass. Okay, that makes sense. So it's like a just regular battle pass kind of thing. The battle pass. The battle pass. Yes, battle pass. Okay, uh, what is this? Obtain arc XP upon premium purchase. Man, get that bullshit out of here. I don't want to freaking buy it. I don't want to pay money for this. Maybe if maybe I will. Maybe if I like it enough. I bought I like I bought bought but ugh I can't speak. I've bought battle passes before. I, I don't know if I want to buy this one. I bought a bunch of Apex ones. And TFT and Dota. So I'm not opposed to buying battle passes. I don't know if I just want to do this. Do, wait, what is this? Do we just claim all of this? Obtain selected rewards? Oh. 500 pirate coins? What is this? Ooh, um, Black Fang? Black Fang? I haven't seen Black Fang in a while. Kind of sad. I want to see Black Fang. Remind me of Black Fang. What is this? Ascendant Honing Chest. Oh, we get some Destruction Fragments. We need those. We definitely need those. Oh, so we have the uh, free reward, and then we have the premium reward, reward uh, obviously, if you buy the Battle Pass, which maybe I might do. Maybe. We'll see. I need to see the rewards, though. What is this? Oh, here we go. Uh, oh, okay. Oh, these are the rewards. Okay, cool. Um, oh, okay. And we, it looks like we have 30 levels for the battle pass. Alright, that's pretty cool. And we get some more stone. These are all very good guys, dude. You guys need to be playing Wall Stark right now, okay? Especially if you're um, trying to, you know, max your character out, get the highest honing item level, whatever. This is going to help you a lot because you're going to be getting these stones. It's a lot of stones, guys. You get one one chest full. This one gives you three chest fulls or three chests of them. Three chests, five of these. A uh, hundred thousand silver, five hundred thousand silver. So many good things, guys. So many good things. Tier three gem chest. So you get some. Uh, oh, it's tier yeah tier three. Just straight tier three gem chest. So this is good. I, I'm pretty sure the gems are for engraving or like faceting or something like that so this is all very good things guys 
obviously you need to play the game because if you don't level up if you don't play the game you're not gonna level up your arc pass so guys you need to be getting your hours in guys get your hours in uh, how do you level it up though you can purchase arc XP plus 100 so yeah okay so this requires um silver to or excuse me not silver the blue crystals to upgrade if you don't feel like you know leveling it up the uh, normal way which is doing the missions so we have these missions here normal missions season miss missions we just got a bunch of things so clear two chaos dungeons complete uh daily una's tasks uh exchange una's tokens blah 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 and we have a whole list of things guys so oh well not not too many on these side this side but you know pretty good it's pretty good guys so we have a bunch of ways to oh and actually there's a lot more on this side actually so these are actually gonna be a lot better to do so yeah a lot of things to love love your battle pass uh, until next reset of weekly xp gained uh five days so it looks like uh, you have five days to complete all these missions uh or as many as you can and then the missions will reset after five days what is this you can complete the season mission only once per season the hidden mission will be revealed at a set date. So there's a hidden mission. So it looks like these guys on the right, you can only complete these once. Um, and then these guys, uh, they will reset every five days. Or uh, I'm not sure when this started, but for right now it's five days, maybe six days. I don't know, whatever. But there we go, that's pretty cool. So we've got some more things. And there should be, there should be more things, right? Uh, more things to help you level up your battle pass thingy or your arc pass. Oh, here we go. Okay, I didn't. This is. I, need, I wanted to find this. So, here's some other things. This is just a different. I think this is another kind of event thing. I don't think this. I don't think this progresses your arc pass. I think this might be a little bit different. Uh, and how I got to this menu was right here. If you guys see my mouse right here, I'm going over underneath the mini map on the right side, clicking the present icon. So you click the present icon, and it brings back this menu. So. Uh, a bunch of things to do. I don't, I'm not. I'm not sure if this levels up your arc pass or not. I, I assume that it doesn't because it doesn't really say about uh, giving giving you XP to the arc pass. But maybe it does. Maybe it doesn't. I don't know. But yeah, two events going on right now: arc pass and uh, express mission. So pretty good time to be playing some Lost Ark, guys. Pretty good time. Uh, we haven't gotten to level two yet. We need 150 XP. We need to do these missions. Uh, I could probably just like, you know, dedicate some time to doing the missions. Uh, but for now, I need to go do some things. So we need to first of all organize our storage because sheesh, this is looking pretty filled up. We need to be using, I need to be using these things, like the engraving things. I don't, I don't know how to use them though. <laughs> I need help guys, I need help. I don't know how to use these. What is this, like magic society pattern region? Like... I don't know what any of these do. Uh, okay, what is this? Oh, we could buy some more storage. Here, let's buy some more storage. We have some crystals. I'm just gonna buy another layer. It's fine. We'll buy another. We'll buy another layer. It's cool. Uh, let's go ahead and put these stone skis in here. So yeah, I need to empty out my thingy because my inventory because we're gonna be doing some quests and stuff. We're gonna need space. What's this? Raid Chromanium. Oh, we can open this one because we got this from the raid. Oh, yeah, we did Chromanium, guys. Uh, I actually had recorded a video of me doing the Chromanium, but I fed completely and I died, like, every single time. Like, I instantly, like, I'm not even kidding when I say I instantly just died every single time. And it, it just wasn't good, so I didn't, I didn't upload the video because, dude, it was so embarrassing. I just got owned. I mean, at least you guys... Well, I don't know why I guys told you that because freaking... Now I'm just embarrassing, embarrassing myself even further, but you know what? It's okay. I don't really care. Um, but okay, let's go ahead and I'm just gonna go put these things. Oh, this is for Striker. Oh, so we have we have a uh, engraving book for a different class. Maybe we could sell that on like the the auction house or whatever. Uh, okay. I, I guess we're good. I, I don't know. Uh, let's go use these things so we get some pirate coins. Um, I'm not sure what pirate coins are used for. Uh, we did learn about them, but I forgot. Probably can just Google it later or something. This is the chest that we got from the Express event. Just open it. Yeah, these things, um, they're kind of stinky compared to what we have now. So we're just gonna dismantle them. Kind of some poo. Uh, dismantle, dismantle, yes. 
And I guess we could dismantle these things. I don't know. So we have a twisted elemental ring. Oh, whoa, but this one's a little bit stronger. Hold on. Let me dismantle these for now. Oh, we got some good stuff in that. Okay, hold on. This one has... Okay, this twisted elemental ring is better than the one that we have on now, right? So this one gives 100 expertise. Wait. Which one is one? Okay, this is the one we have... Oh, no, this one's worse. Okay, man, I'm so dumb. All right, you know what? We're just freaking dismantling. Screw all this BS. I don't even care. Just give me the freaking shards, baby. Yes. Okay. So we got those. Let's open this. This is from the Chromanium, which we did. So let's do that. Oh, we got a um, facet stone. I need to be using these. I don't really know how to use them, though. Uh, let's just open all of these, you know. Screw it. So yeah, we just get some um, accessory items. Oh, is this is this better? So we get more specialization, but we lose swiftness. We get domination instead. Uh, expertise, endurance, expertise, specialization. Um, you know what? I'm just gonna dismantle all these things. All right, guys. Sorry, guys. That was a whole bunch of not doing me doing nothing. Uh, sorry about that. Uh, let's go do some quests, though. So we have to go sing for uh, what's her face? Is Ariel? We have to go sing with her. Uh, I guess that'll be pretty fun. Hopefully, we don't you know screw up. I'll go slow to keep pace with you, Hello B. All right. So now we have to play the Song of Valor. I think, right? Yeah, Song of Valor. Okay. Alright, and we're jamming out pretty hard in our chicken costume, but looking pretty sick, not gonna lie. It's okay. You did well. It's just okay. Man, that's all you could say? I, I thought I did alright. It's just okay? No, no, I'm just kidding, guys. I'm just kidding. Uh, thank you for joining me for my final performance. It was an honor to play with you, Hello B. Yeah, you too. Oh, here we go. Uh, what is this? Sla express slash surprise at Ezreal's comment. Alright, so let's look at our uh, emotes here. Surprised. Whoa. Let me get a little closer look at that. Let me do it again. Whoa. Alright. Cool. For the last 30 years, I didn't think about and I didn't think about anything but music. Every day, I agonized over improving my playing skills. I was so preoccupied with myself that I didn't even try to get to know my band members, Medariel and Fleur off. Fleur off. They probably abandoned me because of my obsession with my own performance. I should really take some time off and clear my head. Yeah, while you're saying that, you're still playing the freaking harp, freaking junkie, ya junkie. Ya music junkie. Oh, we got a roster level up. Hell yeah. Okay, it looks like she doesn't give us the next quest. What is this? Kohenor? What is this? I Man, I don't know what any of this shit is. Whatever. Uh, let's just play the let's just play the game. Uh, we could level up our roster thing, so let's do that. Oh, we can actually do it twice. I didn't even see that. Cool, cool. Uh, okay. I think that's it. Uh, anything else here? Cards. Oh, we haven't done cards in a while, guys. Oh, we can do a four of a kind, actually, now. So, it looks like four of a- it's two of a kind, four of a kind, and then, I'm assuming six, and then eight, or something like that. Uh, we- we don't have many cards. We have a bunch of card packs, though. Like, I'm talking a bunch of card packs. We actually have some right here. Uh, let me open all of these. Let's get this silver here. Uh, so I was actually thinking, guys, in the next video, so in the next video, guys, hopefully you guys are excited for that. Oh, oh no, no, no. Why can't I dismantle this? I'm just gonna drop the item. But yeah, in the next video, guys, um, where I'm gonna be doing a whole opening video. So we're gonna be opening a bunch of things, so hopefully you guys like that. Uh, we're gonna do that probably in the beginning of the video, and then just continue with questing. Did this magic come from the Tower of Dawn? Man, what's going on with these guys, man? These guys are freaking... These guys remind me of the Blood Elves in World of Warcraft. Like, magic people, you know? Magic Elves. And these guys are Elves, I think. The freaking Avin guy straight up looks like freaking Link from Legend of Zelda, so... Wait up. I'm gonna scout 
ahead. <laughs> yeah, giving me blood elf vibes here. But these guys aren't on the horde, so I think these guys are good guys for the most part. Keep monitoring its magic All right, so this guy is for the main quest. We have to talk to Abruth again, our homie here. Uh, but let's check out this uh, side quest here first. Let's talk to Kron here, Mr. Kron. Hmm, I just need to study a little bit more. But where in the blazes are all the other mages? I don't know, man. When I was an apprentice, I used to study magic all night. Ah, you, over there. You came at the right time. Please deliver my letter to the mages who chickened out. Or, I mean, decided to go home. Man, deliver the letter? Man, what do you do that? Freaking A, man. Got me delivering letters and ish. I changed the shapes of my letters so my students will regard them without suspicion. Yeah, you know, whatever. Man, we gotta go deliver some letters to this guy. Freaking A. To some of his his students. Maybe I should cook at home today. What's this? Master Kron's letter? Yeah, freaking get back to work, you lazy bozo. Maybe I should ask Ezreal to teach me how to play the harp. Okay, I'll learn next time. Okay. I should start studying something else. Starting today? I thought it wouldn't start until next week. No, it's today, lady. It's today. Alright, and we have Mage Manit. I need carrots. And... Huh? Master Kron? Well, okay. I won't be going to bed early for a while. Alright, okay. And that's it. Alright, not bad, not bad. Man, I hate these quests, though. Freaking, I hate the delivering the letters quest. So annoying. It's only annoying because it, it, it's just like there's so many of the same quests that, you know, that the main, like different NPCs give. They just give the same thing over and over again. Oh, wait, hold on. Is this the Glavier? Oh, it is the Glavier. Look at this, guys. This is a Glavier. So this is the new class, guys. Glavier. Female martial artist. Pretty cool. Uh, let's talk to Aberruth, though. Uh, I heard about it. What in blazes happened to the fl uh, flame elementals? Before things get any worse, we must find and talk to the flame keeper. It figures he'd disappear just when we need him. Like the Avatar. By the way, about your ally, L, I'm guessing she's somewhere in Rothun. I asked her to wait for you here, but she's not exactly the waiting type. Who's L again? Keep <laughs> its magic levels. Uh, look for Lenora in Rothun. Alright, so it looks like Lenora is down here. What did he say? We must keep monitoring its magic levels. All right, you do that, old you old geezer. I'm gonna go talk to L or Lenora. L, who's L? Uh oh, hold on. Let me check this male guy real quick because we have some stuff from the Chaos Dungeon. Oh, we got a little stone here. Oh, and another stone. All right. Uh, any male? Okay, yeah. Let's delete these males. I want to delete the males. Oh, okay. We just do this. Alright, uh, let's go talk to Lenora. What you got for me? Well, speak of the devil. Hello. Uh, we meet again. Her Majesty Azina told me about you. You're going to Zanila, right? Come on, let's go. Are you in such a hurry to die? I know it's an emergency, but if you enter Zanila without protection, the contaminating magic in there will instantly turn you into a puddle of blood. In short, Zanila is still filled with mutated magic. To remain there safely, you need a special protection spell. Its ingredients are... 7 stems of golden petal thistles, 500 year old glass lotuses, 5 teardrops of the toady king, 100 stems of wind scented dandelions, Elzawind's Dew and Sap, seven generous drops each, and processed solar salt. That's it! Huh? What's wrong? What's wrong? You just named me a freaking Costco freaking grocery list of freaking bullshit that I gotta get. That's what's wrong. Man, what the hell? Avin, you gotta get me out of this horse shit. Alright, thank you, Mr. Link. Just trust me this time. Avin. Although Elswin's dew is way too valuable to give away. Geez, why am I so forgetful? I ran out of Elswin's waterfall water and processed solar salt. I used them all up to make that special invisibility potion for you. You can get those two ingredients anywhere in Rothun. Bring me some, will you? I'll have everything else ready. 
Alright, that's more like it. Yeah, freaking A, man. Freaking telling me to get the freaking whole dang world. Go across to travel the world for this freaking bullshit. I don't got time for that. Oh, look at that. Oh. Wait, I don't think that's good. I don't think that's right from this guy. This guy's a bully. This guy's doing his ice ability on the fire guy. It's not fair. Good. This will save us time. Hell yeah, Will. Your freaking method, your way of trying to do this is freaking whack. Come to Breesom Village when you get everything else. Okay. Alright, so we have to get every. We can find all these things actually in Rothune. So we have to go over here. We have to collect Rothune waterfall water from around you. Okay. Oh! All you need is a good drink to go on a fantastic adventure. Oh! Vista here. Let's check out the Vista. Wait, did we already see this Vista? I don't know. Maybe we did, but let's just check it out again, because Vistas, Vistas are always cool to see, you know? You know, you get a nice little view of the area. Oh, I think we already did see this one, actually, when we first got here. Yeah, really beautiful place. I really like this Rotun place. I actually like it a little bit better than Vern. Vern's a little bit too big. I kind of like small places. It's kind of a little small, you know? Oh, it looks like we actually didn't check out this Vista. We actually got an achievement for our Adventurer's Tomb, so that's good to, that we did that. Very nice, very nice. Right, let's get some of this water here. And then now we have to find Solar Salt from Village Merchants. And where are you? Okay, looks like there's some merchants over here that we could uh, talk to. Oh, lagging a little. <laughs> did this magic come from... Uh, nope, not here. This is where Azariel is. Oh, she's still over here playing the music? Oh, she is. Nice. Oh, she's got, like, a little buddy with her. But her band isn't here anymore, which kind of stinks. <laughs> Looking for something? Yes. Processed solar salt? I just got some in. Give me a moment. There it is. And by the way, you don't need to pay me. I've heard many great things about you, Hello Bee. You're working so hard for Rohandel. This is the least I can do. Oh, wow, we got like some, we're getting some free stuff. Wow, thanks, man. Looks like, um... We're in some, like, upper echelon here. We got some special treatment going on. Okay, so we have to meet Avan, who is at Breesome Village, right? Okay, let's just try port over here. Let's go over there, and then hopefully figure out what's going on. Because, like I said, I still kind of have no idea what's going on in this area. All I know is that dream demons are messing up the magic in Rohendel, but I haven't seen a dream demon. All I've seen is a giant humanoid dragon guy. I don't know if that's a, a dream demon, but maybe it was. So, but yeah, hopefully we can get to the bottom of whatever's going on. <laughs> Everything's prepared. Very nice. Where's Lenora, you ask? Hmm. Don't get me started on that impatient Sylvain. As soon as she checked the ingredients, she left for Zanila. But worry not, you've got the talented former member of the Dawn Keep right here with you. The potion may require many different ingredients, but making it ourselves is simple enough. Voila, it's completed. Now, bottoms up. Are you sure this will work? Yeah, I'm kind of skeptical about if this will work, because the first time he did it on us, he turned us into a frog. So, it's not that... I don't know if he's like the greatest scientist out there. Uh, what? Why wouldn't it work? Come on, the Queen chose me as her agent for a reason. Don't worry, everything's gonna be okay. Just so you know, it might taste like toady droppings. I suggest you swallow it as quickly as possible. Okay. Fine, Avin. I'll trust you this time. You goober. Talk to Avin. Naturally, you won't feel anything right away. Now stand on the magic circle and wait. We'll leave first. Turan, come on, follow me. Alright, we gotta stand on this little magic circle. Kinda sketchy, but I guess we'll do it, Avin. I guess. The, ins uh, the inside of my body warms up. Uh, okay, what happened? We got an item? What is this? Oh, it's for Adventure's Tome. Okay, cool. Uh, Alright, so now we can actually enter in the, uh, what is it? The Zanila Ruins, which is, I believe... Uh, the second to last place we gotta go to for Rohendel, and we're, and we're finished here. Spell, I see. You may proceed to Zanila. All right, thanks, buddy. Yeah, we're almost done with uh, Rohendel, guys. So this is gonna be pretty sick. Making some good progress here. Ooh, cutscene, cutscene. What's going on here? Oh, and the whole the whole aesthetic is just completely changed. The trees are dead. All this village just looks completely destroyed. Wow. 
what a difference, what a night and day difference between Rothun and like uh, this place. Wow. What's going on here? Got like the slave pens here? What is this? Got like people working? And we have a big tower in the back. Probably the place that we have to go. All right. So here we go. We're at the uh, we're at the Zanila ruins, and a pretty big place, if you ask me. Pretty large. So got a lot of things we got to do here. Oh, we got our first enemies: mutated Zanilan beast. Let's go ahead and just fight these guys. All right, we do a decent amount of damage, but we're we're not like completely one-shotting them, you know. So these guys might be kind of tough. Oh, we can break these rocks. That's pretty cool. Oh, our death fire is pretty strong against those guys. Oh my god, this guy's, this guy's rushing at me. Hey, back off, man. Oh, we got Avin and Terrains. It's still a disturbingly quiet place. Indeed. It feels like the city is suspended in time. Where should we look to find Lenora? Wait, someone's coming this way. Running. Huh? It looks like a Bambiri kid. Bambiri? Escape Bambiri <sighs> Taru. They're not following me anymore, are they? Who's following you? Who? I finally ditched them. Huh? Who are you? Who are you? A Bambiri, a Sylvain, and an outsider. How very interesting. What happened to you? Uh, nothing special. I was hauling rocks as usual when I accidentally bumped into one of those constructs. And, uh, I also might have stepped on a few tails while I was running away from the construct. I still can't believe they, uh, followed me this far. Wait, what just happened? There's like this little thing that showed up on my screen. Oh man, I couldn't read it. Have you seen a Sylvain named Lenora? Oh, the Sylvain lady? Sheesh, don't even get me started. The entire encampment was talking about her. The other Sylvain said she's a high-ranking mage. If you know her, I hope you take her away with you. What? What does that mean? You're not hurt. Are you? <clears throat> that woman. <clears throat> she wasn't going to wait for us from the start. Why in Arkesia did she go all the way to the Bambiri settlement? If she had, if she had a reason, she should have told us. She's just like the rest of Dawnkeep, secretive and stubborn. Let's go to the Bambiri settlement. Oh sure, let's just pick right up and go. Hmm, I'd like to think that she's looking for something. Whatever it is. Ugh, just my luck. Okay, okay. Let's go to the Bambiri settlement. Let me take a break. I mean, uh... Alright, sorry, I had something in my mouth, or my teeth. Uh, the relics and beasts are out of control, but I guess that's nothing new. A while ago, one of the grown-ups in my village got gored by a beast and had an awful injury. Hey, you gotta teach those relics and beasts a lesson. I'm sure Chief Batum will give you, uh, something in return. Ooh, we get some shards, too. Nice. Okay, I'll do that. Do some beast slaying. Are these relics? Are these rocks the relics? No, they're not. Uh, let's go fight these beasts, though. So we gotta fight these little beast guys. And I believe, yeah, we can fight them down there, too. So we can, we can just uh, fight them down there as well. Uh, and it looks like there's like a little like uh, settlement there at the bottom. Maybe that's the Bambiri settlement. Well, like some uh, shopkeepers over there. Oh, we got a little uh, quest here. De defeat violent relics and beast. What are these relics? Why do they keep saying relics? I don't see no relics. I mean, debated. Oh, nice. Oh, here. Oh, okay. This is what a relic is. Oh, shoot. This guy's an elite relic. Gotta be careful. Nice. Alright, so we complete the first quest. Uh, let's just complete this little... Uh, what are these? I still I don't know what these are called. Oh, we completely whiffed our ability. Whoops. I call them zone quests. I don't know what these are, though. The red quests. Yeah, let's just complete this thing real quick. Just gotta fight some more of these little... Uh, the relic guys. Oh, 
Oh, we missed. Sorry, I'm not that good at this game. I'm trying, though. I'm trying my hardest, guys. I'm trying my hardest not to be a noob so you guys, you know, can, like, at least watch and be like, oh, this guy's actually somewhat decent, you know? And not be like, wow, this guy freaking completely stuck, sucks freaking butt cheeks, you know? I'm trying, guys. I'm trying to be good at this game. I'm trying. We must protect the queen. Facts. Magic stabilized? Um, not yet. Okay, so it looks like we have like a Sylvain encampment here. It doesn't. I don't think these guys have the Bambiris, right? Be prepared, everyone. I like. I like this dialogue. Interesting. Very interesting. If you guys heard that. All right, let's just go over here. We got to do the quest, poos. So let's go do that. We gotta go to the Bambiri village, which is right here. Oh, okay. Um, okay, so we got the Bambiri village. What is this? Oh, it look, looks like they're growing like some crops here or something. Uh, so here are the Bambiris. These guys uh, can't use magic, and they live with the Sylvains. But the Sylvains can use magic. Alright, so let's go over here. Let's talk to uh, Bambiri Chief Batum. This explains the loud noises. Thank you. We should go and retrieve the broken horns of those beasts. Who knew I would meet Sylvains twice in one day? I ain't no Sylvain. This village hasn't been this lively for a long time. Have you seen a Sylvain named Lenora? Did you really come looking for that unruly Sylvain mage? She's not here, and thank the gods. Not only did she bother everyone at, about Gerdia, but she also turned this whole place upside down. Eventually, uh, she said she was going to see Prate, who is cooped up in the moon keep. Let me tell you, I feel sorry for Prate. Wait, what? What's going on? Come on. I want to work now. Lenora is searching for any trace of Gerdia. But why did she have to go to Prate? If I never seen that Sylvain again, it'll be too soon. Uh, I suppose, uh, I suppose, I suppose have no choice? No, no, no. I suppose I have no choice. Or I suppose we have no choice. Let's head to Moonkeep. Uh, it's got some grammar errors there. That, that one's just completely missing a Abin? word, but all good, all who's good. Prate? Yeah, Avin, who's Prate? A very greedy mage. Okay, so Prate is a greedy mage. Good to know, I guess. Good to know. Alright, we got some quests here that opened up. So, that, I do like that. I do like me some quests. So, we got Setu here. Adventurer. What was the first thing you saw when you glanced upon the ruins of Zanila? Believe it or not, I saw hope. The land is dry and cracked, sure, and even contaminated by the magic eruption. But it still, but it still can grow plants. I know it. I have been experimenting with various seeds. Care to assist me with my research? Yeah, I guess. This could be kind of cool. So let's plant some seeds for Setu over here. So it looks like this place is the cause, the causation of the magic eruption. Made this place very, very... It, it pretty much just destroyed the place. Darn, it failed this time. But just look at that field, all filled with plants. I'll keep looking for ways to grow other plants, at least until the field dries up. All right, said to you do that. So that's that, that's some little. We got some little lore there. We got some lore there. So with the people here, the Bambiris here, they are still trying to make. Uh, they're still trying to heal this land. So that's cool. I like that. They're still doing what they can. All right. So to accept this other quest here. Oh, this guy looks down bad. Uh, I couldn't stop. It's attack. My village is in danger. Don't. Look into its eyes. Please be careful. Ah, uh, man, what is this guy talking about, bro? Just freaking spit it out already. Or go to the hospital, bro. This is not the right place to be. If you are badly injured, and we got people just walk around, walking around idly, staring, standing by, and they don't even give a fuck about this guy. Man, you need. We need to get this guy to the hospital, bro. Or who is this? Yaya. Yeah, yeah. Who's this? Find the first trace of the beast. Oh yeah, okay, so this is the beast. It's eyes. Oh, she's freaking out. What's this? Oh, this guy's this guy got fucked up too. Man, what is going on here? The feces of the beast, smaller than expected. 
Meow. Wait, what? <laughs> what? This, this is the beast they're talking about, little kitten? The cat jumps inside the chest. What? That's what defeated these strong soldiers? Come on, man. Ah, take it away. Thank you so much for wrangling that beast. It must have stowed away on a freight ship. Sheesh, I don't know what to do with it. Man, what the hell? Adventurer, that is to say, friend whose opinion I trust. I'd like to ask you something. Alright, what do you have to tell me, you freaking pansy? It's hiding its sharp claws for now, but once it's fully grown, it will terrorize our kind. Even so, I don't feel right about killing a cub. How do you think the other, vill uh, other village vampires feel about this? Man, what? I have to ask them about if they want to kill the kitten or not? Ugh, oh, it's eyes. I can never forget those eyes. Look at those sharp claws. We need to face this threat head on. Are you kidding me, guys? But still, maybe we should let it go. Alright, I understand how they feel. But now I'd like to hear your opinion, friend. What should we do about this kitten? Send it back. I'll leave that to the Bamberries. Send it back, man. Okay, if you say so. I agree, I'll send it back on the next cargo ship that arrives. The cat will remember your choice. Whoa, interesting. So it looks like we have a breaking of the third wall or fourth wall or whatever. And it's a yellow text, so it's like, I think it's my thoughts maybe, or the game's thoughts, narrator's thoughts. And it says, the cat will remember your choice. This cat, I think it just licked its lips looking at me. Hey, I'm not a fish, I'm a Bambiri. Yeah, and also a giant wuss. Which is scared of a kitty cat. Not gonna lie though, some cats can be pretty scary. Uh, pretty ferocious, you know. With the ro oh, oh, I thought that was something we could do. But yeah, my experiences with cats, I've always had good experience with the cats. I've never had a bad experience with the cats. Knock on wood, you know. But yeah, I've never had bad experience with cats or with dogs. I have met very like mean cats though before that have scratched me before, but it wasn't like a like a like I, I wasn't like being attacked or anything. It was just like it was just like a very like stubborn cat and just very fair like protective feral cat. But it wasn't like crazy. Yeah, I wouldn't necessarily call that an attack. Like it didn't like attack me, but like, it definitely did scratch me. But I, think I wouldn't call right that an attack. Like I know what being attacked feels like. I've been freaking chased by goose before, dude. I remember one time as a kid, dude. Story time, by the way. I remember one time as a kid, we had in my neighborhood, right? We have this pond in our neighborhood. Now, as a kid, I would always play in there and stuff, and just like I don't know, just do things. So it was fun. Like I don't know, I was a freaking kid, just playing at, around with the nature. It was fun and. Basically, there was a family of geese there, and my brilliant idea was to go and go up to the geese, and that was pretty much the worst idea I've ever thought of, because once I went up to the geese, they freaking all started freaking like flying and started attacking me, and I was like, oh my gosh, that was scary. Uh, fortunately, they didn't get me. I ran away a little bit too fast, but yeah, that was scary. That was like the first time I ever got like attacked by like an animal, dude. They freaking had the squad pull up on me. There was like a whole bunch of them. So it's kind of scary. But anyways, story time over. Let's talk to Avin now. So he says, I think we're in the right place this time. This area is practically reverberating with Lenora's voice. Why don't you go downstairs and help her? I'll check the records in the moon keep here. Frankly, I'll jump at any excuse to avoid Prate. <sighs> Several flame elementals attacked the storm temple. How, how, how is she Kadia talking to me? Is the flame keeper. There is no way he wasn't aware of this. I have to wait and see. I guess. How is Lenora talking to me? What is this? No, I'm not gonna do that. Alchemist though, that's a cool thing. So it looks like you could do something with the alchemy thing. That's pretty cool. Oh, okay, I missed the elevator. Whoops. Oh, was there a Mokoko seat here maybe? Anything? Drat. No. Coco seed. Alright, let's we gotta wait for the elevator again. So we're in the moon keep right now. Um which is a part of the Bambiri village. And it looks like Gerdia, the flame keeper, maybe the flame elemental is something's going on with them. I don't even know. 
Something's going on. Something bad is happening. This Lenora lady just left us. She didn't even leave with us. She's doing things on her own accord. I don't even know what's going on. We we're hearing her voice and shit. Lenora, your friends are here. Uh. All right, let's talk to Prate. I've heard about your story. Thank you for stopping the magic eruption in Rohendo. However, you used a demonic method to do so, or at least that's how the rumor goes. There was no other way. Nonsense! If I was there, I would have, n I would never have approved it. Man, shut up. What were the keepers doing instead of stopping you? Spineless is what they are. They need a firm leader like me to. But enough of that. Lenora seems to be suspicious of Gerdia, but she's wrong. Gerdia would never do such a thing. He's doing his best to purge the contaminated magic coursing through Zanila. I don't know, man. The way you talk to me, you seem like you're freaking. Stuck up you don't know what you're talking about. Uh, we had to talk and ask for help to in tracking down Gerdia. Okay, so we used the talk emote. No, I don't care who you are. I'm not gonna help you. All right, well then, screw off. I don't even want to talk to you. You're more diligent than I thought. Yes. Prate is a stubborn mule, but I understand his reasoning. Given how much Gerdia contributed to restoring Zanila, Prate would never cooperate with me. I'll just have to do this my, uh, my own way. Tell Avan upstairs to check the ruins nearby and collect relic fragments. They should contain traces of Gerdia's magic, uh, which he used to restore Zanila. Okay. Gerdia is wise. I like this little camera angle. It's pretty cool. It's a nice little change, you know. The research isn't done yet. Okay, research isn't done. I just want to check out the area. You know, it's not that. Oh, Makoko seed. Very nice. Yeah, this is cool. All right, let's get back on the elevator. Let's go talk to Avin. didn't go well, did it? So, uh, what should we do now? What? Check the ruins and gather relic fragments. 500 of them? Dot dot dot. Sigh. I'll contribute the ones I nabbed for, uh, research purposes. Let's look for the rest of them. Yeah, this Lenora lady has been giving us so much freaking just terrible things to do. On, let's gather these books. Or what's left of them. Wait, wait, where'd they go? What the hell? Did they just disappear? Okay, so it looks like we gotta get out of here. We have to talk to Lenora near the ruined castle. This area. So, uh, we gotta find the ruined castle. Find Gerdia, see what he's doing. Make sure- what the? We just like instantly entered. That was weird. Uh, okay, and where are you, Lenora? Okay, looks like she's down here. Alright. Uh, hold on, actually. Uh, we can click this. Okay, what else can we click? Can we click anything else in inventory? I don't think we can. Alright, let's talk to Lenora here. But yeah, so far I've been liking uh, this uh, zone a lot better um, than from when it first started. Definitely picked up a lot more as you get uh, progressed through the zone, uh, entire zone. Because it was kind of boring at the beginning, not gonna lie. Uh, everything's ready on this end. Okay, go ahead and place what you found here. Good, now let's see where Gertie is hiding. Let's hurry and find the flame keeper. <sighs> this place gives me the creeps. Did it fail? Indeed it does. How oh, strange. There's no way the elementals have forgotten about him. It isn't possible for Zanila to be totally devoid of Gertie's traces. They must have been erased. As things stand, uh, stand, we won't be able to find him. We need something that belonged to Gerdia. I'll bet Prate has something like that. Drat, I already feel tired. Just thinking about the long argument I'll be having with him. Yeah, me too. This guy's a freaking what pain. That? Didn't you say some time ago that you received an entry pass to the port? Yes. I mean, the permit you got from Gerdia. I don't know much about magic, but maybe that can help. Oh, we've already met Gerdia before, right, right. Did we? I think we did. Oh, he was the one who gave us the pass. I'm so oh. dumb. This is definitely helpful. Yes, this should do. We have certainly saved some time, thanks to you. Thank God. 
Can you, uh, please place it on the magic circle again. Alright, it's better work this time. Long ago, oh, what the hell? Our greed brought ruin to Zanila. Gerdia in the Earth's memory. What? Long ago, our greed brought ruin to Zanila. Okay. Gerdia examines the debris and mumbles. We need to follow Gerdia's tracks. Protected Rowendell. If only I could control this power, I could have protected Rowendell. Let's follow his tracks. We'll know soon enough. Okay, so let's follow. Garrity gets tracks. We're looking through the memories of the forest. But I can sense or, I mean, the of Zanila's rune. Excuse me, not the forest. Still lingering here. Mm. Alright, uh, so let's go uncover more memories. I should study it. A little longer. Resurrected Zanilin uh, Sylvain. Oh. I require the potent magic of Zanila. This isn't. I require the potent magic of Zanila, but it's not enough. With Zanila's destructive magic. Ah, uh, this confirms it. Confirms what? What just? I don't know what confirms. Gertio was planning something. Okay, here. he was planning something. Okay, okay. Ahead of us is the uh, a village of Zanilan Sylvains. We should ask the Sylvains there what Gertia is up to. Oh, and just so you know, the Sylvains of Zanila look quite different from us. Try to hide your surprise, and whatever you do, don't attack them. Don't attack them. They were Sylvains. Like us. In the past, they were highly accomplished mages. But the massive eru magic eruptions Nila robbed them of everything. Despite the effects of the warped magic on their bodies, these Sylvains remain here to rebuild and to atone for their grave mistake. They will probably be reluctant to give up any information on Gerdia since he has worked alongside them. But perhaps they will talk to you, Hello Bee. Let's see what information we can gather. Okay. Are you still wallowing in guilt? Am I still wallowing in guilt? There! I think he's trying to hide something from us. Man, what is this guy? What are these guys talking about? I think they're still talking to the ghost or something. <laughs> Look at my Oh wow! So these guys do look a little bit different. Go away. Oh, I'm sorry, man. One, two, five. Oh wow! These guys look pretty messed up from the magic eruption. Oh no, it's not good. I, I didn't see anything. One, I, I can't two, hear you. Five. One, two, five. I, uh. You look that scary. I, I can't hear you. Everyone seems to be hiding. Let's look around. Uh, there, footprints. Let's footprints. see where they lead. Footprints where? Man, what footprints? Eh, whatever. Let's go to this locked door. This door is locked. I can hear footsteps on the other side. Okay. Knock knock. Who's there? Hearing something knocked over inside. Who's there? D don't come close. What? Don't talk to me. Uh, I want to ask you something. What are you doing? Uh, what are you doing? Uh, I want to ask you something. G go away. I don't know anything. All right. What? Don't talk to me. What are you doing here? We must repent. We destroyed Zanila. Our skin melted away. Our voices became raw and hoarse. We don't deserve to return to Elzawin, but you. I do not sense fear in you. Are you not afraid of us? I am not. I knew it. Go away. What? Oh, we have to get the we have to get the right dialogue. All right. So it's uh, what are you doing here? And it's I'm not scared of you. You're lying. You're the only person who's not scared of us. Uh, the only per oh, excuse me. You're lying. The only person who's not scared of us is Gerdia. Gerdia did all he possibly could to help us rebuild Zanila. This happened to, Zani uh, to Zanila because of us. Thank you for not being afraid of us like all the others. Whoever you are, I can tell you're strong. I very much enjoy talking to an outsider for the first time in a long time. For now, I can rest. And what the hell? Can I ask you a favor? If you happen to meet someone named Selmos, please tell him that his efforts are futile and he should stop trying. On your, on your way, you may well encounter walking corpses. They wander this place, their souls unable to reach Elzawin. I beg you, put them out of their misery. Release these poor souls. That's what I would want, if that were me. 
I mean, I guess. I don't know if this is my responsibility, but I guess I could do it. I mean, maybe. All right, so we gotta search for some lost luggage. We have to, and we have to fight some of these Sylvain guys. So let's do that. Cool. Oh, we got an elite guy here. Resurrected Sylvain. Let's fight the elite Sylvain guy. That'll be pretty cool, right? Oh, we have two elites here. I didn't even realize that. Alright, uh, both of them down. Very nice. Oh, we should've got a little bit closer. We would've been able to finish these guys off. We can just snipe them down though, no biggie. All right, let's complete this quest here, boom. Oh wow, we've been leveling up our, we're getting a lot of roster level up, which is pretty good. I think we got one at the beginning of this video too. There's a village down there. It looks like little more than ruins. Oh, what the, I thought I took the elevator. We'll know when we get there. Alright, let's get on the elevator. See what's going on at the uh, village, the Sylvain village. Oh, what the? It's like a freaking crawler guy. Oh. Who is this? Jetico? Right, let's just avoid this guy. I got some creepy little laughing over here. Laugher. Let's get this triport. Oh, we got Lenora here. Alright, so it looks like we're at the uh, contaminated village. Fortunately, they don't seem to be fearful of us. Maybe he can tell us about Gerdia. Maybe. Let's greet Eliko. And who might you be? What brings you to this place? We have remained here atoning for our sins for centuries, and yet no one has ever come to us as you have. Rohendil has experienced a magic eruption. Flame elementals are causing the eruption. I'll just go with the first one. A magic eruption? Is Her Majesty Azena safe? No, don't tell me. I don't deserve an answer. But a magic eruption? It must be stopped. Flame elementals are causing the eruption. Flame elementals. Then there's no way Gerdia could not have known. But Gerdia is more dedicated to Rohendel than anyone else. He would never, would he? No, no, this can't be. Some time ago, he stopped by the village. He ended up leaving with a few villagers, like he always does. He said they were leaving to purge the old village. I'm sorry to say, the villagers still haven't returned. Uh oh, is Gerdia a little sketchy? Is he a sketchy guy? Gerdia, he wouldn't. Gerdia left with several Zanil and Sylvains. What could he possibly be up to? We should head to the place that Sylvain told you about. And we had better hurry. I have a feeling time's of the essence. Alright, oh, we got a little side quest. Right? Nothing bad happened to them, right? Not sure. Alright, let's uh, get this little quest here. I said something. Interesting. You cannot be forgiven. You, what have you done? What, uh, what you've done can never be forgiven. What did I do? You killed my friends. I didn't kill anyone. You did. I saw you do it. They were already dead. No, you're lying. According to the re results of my research, <laughs> I can bring them back to life, and I will prove it to you. Follow me. This way. Wait, what? What is this guy doing? <laughs> Please forgive us. Look, look. Let me introduce you to my friend, Asareth. Do you understand now? Look, look what you've done. Is he truly? Oh, hold on. Let me take a look at this thing. What the hell is this? And he says, "Hmm, hmm." Oh wow, this guy looks pretty cool. Not gonna lie. He does not look like he should be alive, though. Definitely looks like he's in pain. Uh, okay. 
He looks dead, but look at his eyes. I, I know what I'm talking about. He's not attacking us. See for yourself. All right, let's talk to him, I guess. We'll see if he's uh, not hostile or not. Now you know, don't you? I shall give you a chance to make things right. Fetch me some cliff herbs from around the village. Those herbs are wondrous. They can bring Aserith back to life. I swear it. Are you sure, man? Make sure to get the freshest of them all. This guy seems sketchy, but... I mean, I guess we'll do it. I'm kind of uh, curious as to see what's going to happen. <laughs> Alright, so we're just collecting some herbs. We should have enough now. Alright, cool. Let's go talk to Selamos again. Give him this medicine and we can go back. Um, here's some medicine. Err? 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 What? What happened? What? Okay, it looks like this quest is probably part of the final quest. So it looks like this guy can resurrect dead uh, Zanil and Sylvains? Dear me, what's that? I just saw a, a dead Sylvain running outside the village. Selamos was hot on his trail. I wonder what happened. Oh, this is the last part of the quest. Okay. Yeah, I wonder what happened. What's this? Oh, hold on. We gotta fight this guy. This guy. Oh, okay. Never mind. We don't. There are large footprints. Follow Aserith's tracks. It was struck with something hard and broke. Okay. Oh, it's an Aserith right here. Bloated Zanil and Sylvain. Oh, shit. Oh, wait. Aserith is dead. Wait, what? What happened? I should have known this would happen. Just as I did back then, it was our mistake. We can never undo what we have done, as with Aserith. Just like with Aserith. You're not totally to blame, Sel uh, Selmos. Well, actually, you kind of are, so I'm just going to say I don't know what to say. But what is all our what is our alternative? We brought all of this upon ourselves. I am sorry, I truly am. Thank you for accompanying me, man. Get away from me, you weirdo. Just give me the battle item chest. Alright, and perfect. This is actually on the way to the uh, main quest here. Uh okay. All dead. They're all dead, uh oh. That's not a good sign. Oh, hopefully these guys won't attack me. Alright, cool. dead. Uh-oh. See this? This corpse has no magic left in it at all. It's just an empty husk. These people, they didn't even put up a fight. Gerdia, what in blazes did you do? Uh-oh, so it looks like Gerdia purged the village. And by purging, obviously, he fucking wiped them all out. This proves it. Gerdia, he... Need to find out what happened to them. Or at least, this, this is an allegation. This is not my assumption. We, we could be totally wrong. Gerdia could be... Uh, pulling, like, the greatest freaking double agent of all time. I don't know. We'll see what happens, though. Uh, I want to see what Gerdia did to them with my own eyes. Please place the object you have here. It will help us determine what happened. Alright, so let's look at the memories of the, uh, area. Oh, it's cutscene, cutscene. Excuse me. What is this place? Where exactly are we going? <sighs> Lord Gurdia. It's time. Oh yeah, this guy looks evil as shit. Oh! What is the meaning of this? <laughs> All right, yeah, Gerdia is definitely not pulling a double agent move. This guy is just pure this evil. Should be enough. He is pure evil. I mean, that is just some savage shit happening right there. Oh no. 
This piece of shit. Shaking my head. Gertia. He has done the unthinkable. Facts! I think if Sylvain managed to run away, they must be somewhere nearby. Let's try to find them. Oh, wait, what? Sylvain got away. Where? Where they at, though? Where they at, though? Oh, this guy's gonna attack me. Get away from me, you freak. Respectfully, though. Respectfully. These guys have been through a lot, alright? That's... Those guys are Sylvains. They've just been... Uberly corrupted by the magic. I'm just gonna go avoid these guys. I must... Okay, it looks like we can't avoid. Let's just. Oh, okay, we can. Uh, Zapira. This is the. Oh, this is the escaped Sylvain. Wow, this is the guy who escaped. Oh God. Why didn't I realize this earlier? And then we have to applaud him. What? Why can't we like heal him or something? Why are we applauding him? What? Makes no sense. This guy just went through a traumatic ass event, and we're freaking clapping you, for him. You are. I. I was a fool. We must stop Gerdia at all costs. He promised he could restore Zanila back to its former beauty, so I let him leave with the villagers. If only I had hit this research journal beforehand, I would have known how truly mad he is. The realm of elementals, he must be stopped. Okay, so Gerdia, 100% a bad elementals. guy. Appropriate, he would escape to such a place. So the realm of elementals sounds like a dungeon to me, boys. So I'm pretty excited. Probably not going to put the dungeon in this video, because this video's already been going on for quite some time, so... We'll do it in the next one, but let's... Might be let's talk to Lenora. Research? Let me see. He drained their magic in order to travel to the realm of elementals, but why? I have a, f a terrible feeling about this. Let's return to Moonkeep. I won't allow Prate to cover from Gerdia's crimes any longer. Huh? What? Oh no, a surprising guest is... Wait, but what? Oh, what the... the realm of elementals. Gertius, research? attacking me. Let me see. Uh, a surprising guest is waiting for us in the tower? What tower? Oh, Moonkeep? Oh shit, okay, what's happening here? Uh-oh, what's going on? Okay, oh, what the? Oh, these guys are just, they're just having like a war happening right now. Mini war. Alright, what's happening? This place hasn't changed anything. Oh, it's a Xana! Prate told me everything. I reprimanded him for his foolishness. He will help you from now on. Judging by the looks on your faces, you must have learned something. Tell me what happened. What's that? Gertie's research journal? You can't be serious. The realm of elementals? How did he get there? I see. It all becomes clear. I know why the flame elementals attacked the storm temple. They were trying to weaken the powers of the ancient elementals so Gerdia could imprison them in their realm. But it's physically impossible for the Sylvains to travel to the realm of elementals. What type of magic did Gerdia use? We should ask some mages for their opinion. Does Avin have an opinion? We'll, we'll, just, we'll, we'll go with our boy Avin, fine. Avin, good idea. He probably understands Gerdia better than anyone else. I'll leave that to you. In the meantime, I'll be here uh, getting my thoughts in order. Okay. As humiliating as it is to say, this will be tough. The realm of elementals. It's in a completely different dimension. We are not nearly strong enough to even reach that fabled land, but there has to be a way. Of course. Yes, we must join forces at times like these. All right, let's go ahead and talk to all the mages there here. Must be research records about it. Gertia once mentioned some kind of yeah. special material. Their location. Man, everyone's talking all at the same time. Chill out, guys. Could anyone travel between dimensions? I don't know. Creating a special rift should come first. There were once people capable of also presents a problem. <clears throat> if something could act as. Guide. Yes. Man, I don't even know what happened. What, what just happened? Because everyone was talking over each other. I can't freaking hear what they're saying. All right, let's do this. Yeah, I guess let's do it. Screw it, let's do it. 
We found the way, it's fine. We have to create an interdimensional rift large enough to reach the realm of elementals. Rem remember the method we used to get to the storm temple? Yes, the way we harnessed that chaos magic along with the branch? We used the same method, though of course we need significantly more magic than we did to create the rift uh, to create the rift to the temple. Uh, we need to use the Xana's power What by using the Keeper's power. What, what's it, what, are, what are these? I'm gonna go with the Xana because she's bae. I agree, reluctantly. Her Majesty the Xana is exhausted, but she's the only one we can rely on at the moment. Hello B, please talk to her. Alright, Xana. Do you have something to say? Yes, marry me. Just kidding, just kidding. Uh, so you need my power to create an interdimensional rift, you know? That's a pretty dangerous notion. Tip the scales of magic like that, and you could cause the same tragedy that destroyed Zanila. Uh, I believe in you, Azena. I thought you believed in Avin. Huh, alright. Well, I'd better live up to your expectations. That said, you did help me stop the eruption of the Storm Temple. Hello, B, I'll trust you. This time. Well, show me the divine tree branch you brought. Okay. Imbue the divine branch with Azena's aura. Hopefully this works, guys. This is a wee bit exhausting. All right, let's talk to Avin again. Of course, this is why I like you. Now that we've got the magic, it's time. We augmented with uh, it with Zanila's unique and distorted magic, huh? Don't look so worried. I've got that part covered. What you have to do now is simple. Just place the stone fragment on the ground and stand on the magic circle. Okay. Oh, okay, here we go. Wait inside the magic circle. A cluster of light rises in the nearby area. Uh-oh, are we, are we going? Are we going to the plane of elementals? Oh, no, we're not. Perfect. Let's report back to her majesty. Wait, what just happened? We can now use a divine branch, uh, tree branch to enter the realm of elementals. What? All right, I guess. We will leave as soon as we are ready. Hand over the divine tree branch. Let me see. Yes, it is time. I will use this to open a path to the realm of elementals. Avin and Hello B, you have done well this far. Be sure to take care of any business you have here before you depart. Incidentally, Digni was looking for you. He mentioned that he was uh, has something to give you. After meeting with him, come to the Flamekeeper's Haven. We will leave from there. Alright, so Digni's got a little gift uh, for me. You are quite famous. Oh, is she talking to me? This research was quite tricky. Oh wait, we can we can leave to the store now. We can leave to the store now. Cool. Okay, let's get out of here. Yes, I have decided. What have you decided? Thank you for everything you've done for Rohinda. While looking for ways to reach the realm of elementals, I discovered a portion of Gardia's journal. I recommend you read it before you venture to that land. If you find the rest of his journal. It can help you understand Gerdia's int intentions. Oh, also, there's someone who who I'd like to go with you. He said he uh, he said you helped him once upon a time. I suppose he's taken a shine to you. Please take a, uh, good please take good care of him. Oh, we got a mount. Mount Evening Glow Champ Curry. Oh wow. Please take good care of this child. All right, let's let's check out our mount. Let's check our new mount out, guys. That was pretty cool. Let's ride this guy. Oh, yeah, I like this. It's just a plain cham curry. We have the soda cham curry, which I do like, but I kind of like the plain one too. I like both of them. All right, let's get off. Let's uh, read Gardia's journal. F five. Okay, we're reading the it's journal. It's taking too long to purge Zanila's contaminated magic. I pleaded with Queen Azena to use the power of the Divine Tree. She refused. When the demons invaded Rohendel, I sensed a great change. The powers of Elzawen and Queen Inanna grow ever weaker. Is that all? Azena, Inanna. And the other Sylvains in Rohandel have abandoned Zanila. They're neglecting what's happening here. Okay. So we're getting a little bit of insight about, you know, his, in, like, why he did the things that he did. He claims that uh, 
the you know higher ups at Rothun have have neglected Zanila and they're not paying attention to it. So he's thinking, I have to take matters into my own hand. But I don't understand why he had to kill those people. But let's maybe we'll uh, uncover more clues. Let's talk to Delphi though. We got a quest here. These walking corpses, they used to be Sylvains, just like us. I believe some of them even used to be powerful mages. We must put an end to this by reinforcing the magic wards around their graves. If you see candles, please sprinkle this magic powder over them. Alright. Alright, so let's go and uh, do some more quests, guys. Oh, we got some more quests here. Defeat the resurrected Zanilans. Okay. Zanilan Sylvains. Alright, let's go ahead and do that. We got some more quests to do. This video is going to be a little bit longer because, you know, I just feel like playing a little bit more. I kind of want to just, like, do everything in this area. So, yeah, we're, we're probably going to end off, um, we're probably going to end the video before we, uh, enter the, what was that, the Plane of Elementals or whatever it was called? The, the Realm of Elementals or whatever that shit was called, so... We'll probably end it there. It's probably gonna be happening soon too, so. Uh, we have to search for Gertius tracks. So we have to kill also some more of these uh Zanilin guys. Okay, we're gonna kill a couple more. And then we have to find Gertius tracks. So we're tracking down Gertia. We need to find them. At least just be like, hey man, why'd you do that? Like well, what are you doing? Or at least just like question him a little bit. Figure out what's going on in his mind, you know. Because right now he's gone rogue. He has officially gone rogue. He has gone against the Rothun um, Empire, government, whatever, and he's taken things into his own hand. And I'm kind of curious as to why, you know? Because I mean, he may have a good reason. I mean, he doesn't seem like a bad guy. I don't think. I hope not. Oh, here we go. Here's Gerdius tracks. Before the divine tree Alzawin grows any weaker. We must study and extract its secrets. Only the great tree's power can restore Zanila to its former glory. Ephernia has agreed to my plan, but the elementals are strongly opposed. We must journey to the realm of elementals. It worked. I can seek their approval. The passage to the realm of okay, so he's trying to. Um... <laughs> Amazing. The Elementals disapproved of him using Elzewin's magic to heal Zanila, so he's pretty much just saying, "Screw it, I'm just gonna go there, and we're gonna do. I'm gonna do it myself." Impressive. You managed to accomplish Finally, quite a difficult task. The passage task. to the realm of Elementals has been opened. Oh, okay, Zena. The realm of Elementals is open. Hello, B. We must venture inside and put an end to Gerdia's schemes. I'm down. Good. Now let's do all we can to stop the flame elementals. Please. You must stop Gerdia and the flame elementals. My friend. Please be safe. Please be safe. Alright, well let's get another shot of uh, me and Bay, Azena here. And I think I'm going to end the video here, guys. Got a lot of things done today. Um, finally getting um, more to the bottom of the mystery of what's going on with the magic explosion. It looks like Gerdia is has something to do with these things. Also, maybe the dream demons. We know now that Gerdia has headed to the plane or the realm of elementals to kind of take matters into his own hand, try to get the power of himself, of the elementals, to use Elzwin's magic to heal Zanila. Uh, we'll probably figure out more about, um, you know, what his intentions are as we go through the Realm of Elementals and probably fight uh, Garadia. We'll figure out what's going on. Maybe he has, like, a bigger boss that he's looking up to, or I don't know. We'll figure everything out, though. Everything's gonna unfold as we progress through the zone. But yeah, uh, this is a pretty fun uh, episode for me, or, you know, playthrough for, uh, for me. I had a lot of fun. It was really nice. The side quests were actually pretty good this time. I enjoyed the side quests here. Uh, some of them were kind of lame, but you know, it's all good. Um, most of them were actually pretty good. But yeah, guys, uh, if you guys made it this far into the video, I just want to thank you guys all for watching the videos and um, hopefully you guys have been enjoying them. Let me know what I could do better if you guys um, maybe want to comment down below or something like that. Also, make sure you guys like the video and subscribe to the channel more lost art content coming out soon and also i'm going to say this again uh, make sure you guys if you guys are lost ark players if you guys play lost ark 
make sure you guys log in get your hours in um, log in try to log in daily for the uh, login event there's a new uh, express mission event happening right now uh, you can do a bunch of these like uh, like the training rooms chaos dungeons una's task um, i think these ones are the abyssal dungeons so i think all these i don't i think none of these have to do with like um like the continents i think this has to do with more of like the raiding and the dungeons so all very doable you get some really nice rewards from them too so very good uh you, we have that and we also guys have the arc pass so there's the battle pass for our uh, lost arc you guys can go ahead and uh start doing this you can uh, get xp from the missions here level up your arc pass get the rewards uh pretty good rewards also we can look at the i'll show you guys the rewards here we already kind of looked at them a little bit but pretty good get some nice things um but yeah guys uh i think that's gonna be it for me today thanks everyone for watching i appreciate all the views all the support uh, it really brightens my day up and stuff. It's good. It makes me feel better. It makes me feel like I'm doing something right, you know? Um, but yeah, guys, thanks again uh, for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.